Okay, so did you see these that we were, we were putting our little trees on and we can use them as decor, as little pedestals? These are the set of two nostalgic Easter themed nesting books. Absolutely gorgeous. They're two vintage style looking books. They can be used as so many different things. First of all, they could just be coffee table books, right? But literally doesn't it look like it was done from like 1950s? So beautiful. So you're getting both of these and they open up. And I mean, again, you could use them for just decor. Use them as your coffee table books. You can use them to store odds and ends or you can use them as places to help decorate with these. So they're so cute. Uh, Leslie, we were talking about it earlier, like you could do so many different things with these. I know they were super popular when we did them in the Christmas option. And then even we can use them as like gift boxes, right? So if you are gifting something, like an Easter gift, which you always do, it would be much nicer to be able to put it in one of these and give it to them. So true. You know, this makes the gift so much more memorable because this piece will always keep, you know, you, it'll always come out every Easter. Um, the, the books have that um, wooden construction. They've got the gold edging uh, where the pages are on the border. And then they're finished front to back. So whether you're using these in, as decorative pieces, you know, they can stand up and kind of create a little backdrop to your uh, displays. You can use one um, sort of on its side as maybe um, to, to create a little bit of height. And then maybe you want to stack something on top of it. I don't know whether it's the trees or maybe you want to bring um, your truck. If you picked up the truck, let's see if it fits. I don't know. This is live TV. We'll see. It does Perfectly. Fit. Uh, thank you. And you can create a little bit of height there and bring in your um, your little mini trees, the today's bonus buy. Um, so these really create that kind of very finished decorated vignette. It looks like you've been collecting and layering these pieces together for years and years. And yet you just started, you just decided, Hey, I love this vintage look. I love how it makes me feel. And I love how it makes my house look. So let's bring these pieces together in a way, you know, all of the colors work together, all of the artwork. Um, this has that beautiful kind of vintage greeting card artwork um, layered in with some beautiful vintage patterns in the background. So they're really, there's a depth to them because of the way that the art is layered. That's I the just idea. Love them. That's what it is. Yep. It's to create depth. It's to create height because that's the trick, right? I'm starting to learn all right. those tricks from, from uh, all of our professional decorators. Um, right. If you have it all I'm on one, one table, it might look okay, but you can do that height and now all of a sudden it looks like, oh, something special. Yes. Exactly. I'm not one of those decorators. I listen to them. I listen to what Valerie yeah. is saying. And I know she's always saying, you know, create different, get, bring different heights in. Um, and and uh, this is such a wonderful way to do that. The box, maybe you're going to put Easter pictures into one of these boxes. Maybe you're, you'll pop your Ooh. remote into it and leave it on your coffee table. This could also, by the way, sit on the front hall. It's kind of like a cigar box, by the way. If you think, if you remember those old vintage cigar boxes, it's kind of like that. Um, but it could also go on your front hall and hold all those things. I mean, Rostina, do I clearly want to hide things yes. on my entry hall table? But so do I. I have the same problem. Every single thing. I'm like, maybe you could hide all of the clutter behind this tree. I just, I can't, I can't I'm a sort of <laughs> a one trick pony here. But truly you could put some of that clutter into these boxes. Um, and just, you know, this one says happy spring. It also says happy Easter. The, the same way that we've been talking about, this art is meant to inspire. It's meant to make you feel feel good and it's meant to really get you um, in the, the spirit of the Easter season and spring. And so these are pieces that are going to come out and instantly transform this space, however you decide yes, to use them. absolutely. Now, speaking of happy and, and happy-go-lucky, which is what these really, I mean, the bunny and, and this lammy, uh, wow. But 
Easter should always inspire and does always inspire happiness, right? But this mm -hmm. Easter, I feel like more than ever, are we all going to be celebrating what Easter really means, but then also uh, celebrating that maybe our lives are starting to get back to normal. Maybe we are finally going to be able to be truly together with our families. And this is a perfect way to bring that celebration into our homes. The color, the light, um, the, again, the happiness and that coziness that we're all going to get when our families are finally all together again. Love that. It's so true. And those are the memories, you know, the, the, the decorations, they're, they're fun and they make you feel good. Um, but the memories are about your family and, and, um, all of the attendant, um, love and humor and drama and everything else that you throw in. Um, that's really why we get together, right? We love each other. Yeah, really. I mean, so yeah, these were very popular. 400, uh, picked up, uh, already in, in the sh show. How many are available? Okay. H242117 is your item number. You're getting both of them. Three easy payments of $10.